hey guys welcome to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you that how can you ssh into a server with your keys and not password so I have a server running, uh, which is root at the rate myretica.xyz and I'm using my password right now in order to log in. So here, as you can see, this is server and if I type systemctl status sshd, so this daemon uh, sshd service uh, is running via systemd. So basically my port 22 is open and anybody can make a connection to the server if he knows the IP address. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to SSH without password because right now I'm adding a password. So how can I do it? In order to do it, what I have to do is I have to create a SSH key pair. So if I do CD into my .ssh directory, which is there because I have uh, open SSH installed and you can read this page, which is uh, archwiki for reading about open SSH. So, so if I go to my .ssh directory and do ls, so there is no key pair. Uh, now you don't know what key pair looks like. It's two files so let me just create a search key gen press enter and it's a uh, this enter 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 okay so let me go into dot ssh directory and do ls voila so we got two files so this is my id underscore rsa dot pub and this is id um underscore rsa which is basically my private key and this is my public key so you can share this but you can never share this otherwise you will get fucked so let me scroll up because I think it's not uh, good to, you know, do enter like this. So it's just if in case if you want to protect your keys with a passphrase, so you can do it. And this is just a um, RSA. It, I don't know what this is like. It, it is a random seed or something. Uh, it's written here. The keys random art images. So yeah, that's it. So what I have to do now is I have to get ID underscore RSA dot pub and then copy it. So now I'm not going to copy like this. I, I have this pipe command, which I use always to copy whatever present in my dot pub file. So press enter now the whatever the content of this file is in my clipboard. And if you want to see it, let me just show you it this is my public key okay so that's it so what i have to do is now i have to paste this public key in in my ssh authorize keys file here okay so let me open this authorize key file uh go to insert mode paste it and save it close it so this also as you can see here i don't have any key pair in my server which makes sense i don't need any key pair in my server now since my public key is in authorized keys in my server so what server will do is it will use my private key so every time i try to ssh and it will make a combination with the public key which um, this thing have and if the combination fits in correctly then it will give me access without any password so let me type exit from here and close this terminal and do ssh root at the rate moneyretica.xyz so this time it won't ask for any password whoa see so from my computer or any computer which contains in this uh you know this ssh key pair so you can make and uh, you can basically ssh into root at the rate money ritika.xyz and for other users like other than root uh you might have some other ssh uh, settings like authorized key so you cannot log in there but at root you can do it and if you can do it on root then basically you get the whole system access so that's cool now i don't have to enter any password and i can ssh into my server.